Alright guys, I got a full bag of some 8-shot from Shots Ammo, brand new pulverizer loads, and we're going to be testing the myth, can 8-shot steel shot take down big old Canada geese. Big BB guy here, so we're hopefully going to be out here proving him wrong. If we prove him right, I will never hear the gosh dang end of it, so, so let's hope that doesn't happen. I'm pretty sure with 300 pellets in these gosh dang, shooting over 1500 FPS that, uh, that we can get the gosh dang job done. Hoping for a, for a tight, full pattern with these shells, and we'll catch y'all in the field. We've got an A-frame hide between two hay bales out here in a cut barley field. We've got about six dozen decoys out this morning. Closest decoy to the blind's about 10 yards from it. The furthest decoy is about 35 to 40 yards. If they land anywhere close to these uh, decoys, we ought to be in good shape for uh, taking them down. So, eight shot pulverizer. Will it take down a big old Canada goose? We're about to find out. These gushing ducks want to get it, don't they? It's amazing how six hours south, how much more color they have than the ones up north. From last year. Oh my gosh, boys. Yeah! yeah. Nice! Holy got the last one! I God almighty! I got the last one! Gosh dang, boys. Rain them down. We just freaking messed Eight that shot, fuck baby. up, baby. Oh my, oh my gosh. Oh my god. Holy What just hell. happened? That was crazy. I'm gonna let Blue go. Blue. All right, I'm gonna go pick some up. Holy cow, oh, baby, holy let's crap, go! Boys. Oh, boys, reload. It's gonna get a greasy. Oh my gosh, boys. Yeah! Yeah! Nice. Holy crap. Got the last one. I got oh, the last boy. one. I got the last one. Gosh dang, boys. Right we just down. messed that up. Holy crap. We just freaking messed Eight that shot, baby. Up, baby. Oh my god. One got out. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy what just crap. happened? That was crazy. I'm gonna let Blue go. Blue. I'm gonna go pick some up. <laughs> Holy <laughs> crap, boys. Okay, that was uh, at least. That was crazy. Oh crap, one flew off. Hey, grab your gun, Whitey, for that far one. We just got about 12 in the first flock, boys. That's a great start. Um, I don't know if y'all noticed, but we just we just ground ranked some that we landed um, at about 40 yards, eh, probably 35 yards. Um, shot a couple in there, about 25 yards with eight shot pulverizers. I'd say they did their gosh dang job, baby. Let's go, great start. We're gonna pick these up real quick and get back in the blind. God. Dang, boy, that, that was crazy. That was crazy. Wow. Well, we shot some on the ground just to test out the shells, but what'd you think? <laughs> I think they worked pretty well. They dropped them out there, dude. I mean, dead or doornails. Holy moly. Oh, feels good. Feels to be good. Right back on these gosh dang greasy, greasy Canada geese. Yeah, they didn't know what to do. We landed at the bottom of this hill and they had no idea where we were. So we just kept on, we just kept on dropping them, why not? Golly. Give me some knuckles, baby. Got another flock on the way. Let's go. The, the silent treatment, baby. Got him. Holy thump! Nice shot.
shot, Cole. That thumped it. Hey, then you got the eleventh one out of it. My gosh! Thank you. Thought you were gonna steal it from me. You got well, up. I was waiting. I was gonna give you one shot. I hit my camera real on the way up. You, hit, you got the eleventh one out of the group. That Hell was yeah! That was talking. That's awesome. He read the script pretty good. That was pretty sick. A little spit note turned him freaking hard. Did you see that? Here you go, Bo. Good dog, Blue. I don't know if that's enough proof for y'all or not for uh, not eight shot on honkers, no. but that thing's deader than a doornail. This ammo is awesome. The the wad and these shells keep the keep the pattern extremely dense, and uh, that's that's what we're trying to go for. We want a tense, tight pattern with no holes in it. And that's what this ammo is uh, clearly going after and chasing. A lot of velocity to beh behind it, about 1500 yeah. FPS. Oh, an ounce and three eighths. If y'all don't believe me or don't trust me, I, I wouldn't promote products that are garbage, but if y'all don't trust me, don't. at least give this stuff a shot on some teal or ducks in general, just to start. And uh, if you're slapping them, got a flock of 20 coming. go after the big donkeys. Look, Michael's got his running shoes on like he's gonna be running somewhere. <laughs> he ain't running nowhere, boy. Take these. Take them behind us. Got them. Oh, look at that, boys! Gosh dang! Michael let his dog go, and they kind of these early season birds will come. They will come back for a second round. Um, as long as you stay in the blind, we accidentally sent the dog. Got him back, thankfully, and uh, dropped a couple more. But wow, these might come back for a third time. Oh my god! Oh, I got the last one! <laughs> nice shot! Mega Brain! Damn, don't want to the cherry bird? Oh, yeah. nice! Get him! Reload! Oh, they're still here! Holy crap! Oh my god! Oh, I got the last one! <laughs> nice shot! Go down! Oh, what the heck just happened? What just happened? What what just happened? Was, the, just happened? They lit what, the was there a bunch on the left side already yeah, landed? They lit, and then they, dude, they just all kept coming out. I was like, oh shooting. my was like gosh, dude. <laughs> all right, I, I, I haven't had shells hit this hard. Pulverizer, that was insane. Did you wop, molly wop some or what? Oh, there's <laughs> He's like, yes, I did. Four. Wow. I killed four. Dude, I kept, I fumbled my last shell. I was going to put in my gun to get one more, but dang, I think I got four or five there. Wow. And they are just freaking, literally pulverizing them. They're flipping the geese upside down when we hit them. Uh, I've never seen eight shot do this before, and I am super impressed right now. So, hope you all are enjoying this video. I think we got about 10 more there. They lit on the left side of this hay bale. We couldn't see. I was zoomed in on the uh, ones out front. Trying to turn them, turn them towards uh, the middle of the spread, and uh, they stopped short on the left side. They got to shoot, and they kind of swung over to me. So it was pretty nice. Wow! The ones are getting up, guys. To the right here. Off the water. Yeah. Back, back. Biggins. Sounded like a big dog. 
There's another single out front. Nice shot, nice Whitey. Shot. Kill him. Nice shot, nice Whitey. Nice shot. Heck yeah, eight, baby. Eight shot. Wow. The eight shot. Unbelievable. It nice rips, double. dude. Nice shot, Mike. Perfect. Hell yeah. Woo -hoo -hoo. That was filthy. Right in the pudding. Right man. in the pocket. Absolutely whacking them this wow, this is this is awesome, boys. Been enjoying it. Been enjoying it. We were due. Hey, Blue. We were due. That's for sure. Never let me down today. Eggshells on him. Yeah. <laughs> Look how fluffy he is. <laughs> fluffy. Ha ha ha! Right here. Here. Ha ha! Count, oh, count. Yeah. It's all yours. <laughs> it's all cold. It's cold. It's all yours. Beautiful. <laughs> See the feathers come out of the back? <laughs> Beautiful. Man. Just absolutely whacking them this morning, wow. right in the pocket. This is this is awesome, boys. That was so much fun. We just got done cleaning some birds, eating some breakfast with the boys. Whitey and Michael, they absolutely crushed it today. And the uh Shells were uh, way over expectations. I'll tell you that much right now. I'm brutal, brutally honest. I thought I would kill some at probably 20 yards. I didn't expect to shoot one in the bud at 40, 45 yards and it go down with ease. Shooting eight shot steel. These shells are absolutely incredible. You guys have got to try them out. I know teal season is just around the corner. Give them a shot. Uh, I typically shoot a modified choke and four shot at all waterfowl. I I've always been a big believer in a little bit smaller shot for better patterning and uh, better pillowcased birds. Uh, I know a lot of you probably think you need double BBs, you need three and a half, all this stuff. And I feel like this just proves that you don't need that stuff. I, I am super stoked to have um, eight shot with a completely full tight pattern at 40 yards. I'm act actually blown away from it. So be sure to check out Shots Ammo. Use my code uh, col 10 at shotsammo.com. Super awesome stuff. Be sure to give it a freaking shot. They're a small, small business, USA made, bunch of good, great guys. They're gonna be the next up and coming shotgun shell in the market. I guarantee you that much. Um, I've shot their four shot, it is awesome. So if you don't believe me or trust me, maybe try the four shot. Um, it's an awesome shell too. Oh man, just the design of the wad is what I've been told. I'm not a science, I'm not scientifically, uh, uh, I'm not a scientific advocate to this, but uh, the wad is apparently super awesome, an, an awesome design, different from any other. They've got a cap design to fit more powder, more pellets, so. All that equals more dead birds, in my opinion. So y'all be sure not to forget, August 22nd is the big ducks drop. We've got a bunch of new stuff, new gun cases, new hoodies, new hats, new chokes, new boot, awesome stuff. Y'all be sure to not forget to check that stuff out. Let me know down in the comments below if you've shot any birds with eight shot and also drop a comment. We're gonna be doing a lot of cleaning cooks on birds this year, so drop some recipes or things I can look up down below for some good 
uh, meals, or I guess good way to prepare and cook uh, goose, duck, whatever you, whatever it may be, drop a comment down below. And don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. The last video is doing really well right now, and I really appreciate you guys' love and appreciate you guys watching. So if you're new here, be sure to subscribe. And we'll catch you guys on the next one.